So before I put the mark, what I will do, I check that the overall proportions are correct, okay? I can also think that maybe here I can do some different type of surface. You know, today, a lots of designers use those triangle surface, you know, this triangular design, you know. So why not? Then I put a little bit of light like that just to give an idea it's not the objective it's not to do a full design and then as you can see i changed that that section there to make it more you know inclinated that becomes a little bit more aggressive I will go very quick, huh? Because this, remember, it's just a sketch, marker sketch. You see, I put the reflection there. It's the same thing like the other one. This is a different way. Small space. I just use my chisel point and I just hit it twice in the white area. I will come back to this later. Don't worry. Then I do the wheels. Okay, Ali, Forza. So I use this one that is like a blue between a blue and, and a violet. Okay, let's see what happens. So you see, I'm using this dark. I let it dry after I go back with this marker because I've stopped modeling. Okay, now I take my black and I make that line to make to increase contrast. A little bit on 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 top of my windshield can you see it's, it's starting to look very like a black car dark blue black car okay now let's do the, the wheels the wheel well underneath here it's really dark Okay, so now, last thing we're missing, we need a little bit of light blue, like the sky. You see, look. Now on top also. I take again this dark blue I used before to mix here a little bit better. So I go again. You see, it looks better that way.
You see, I created dark light with a number seven. I went on top of the reflection in the front and I, I hit a couple times to make sure that I get that gradation, you know, that shading. It's better now, before it was too graphic. This is a highlight. And here we have another one. Okay, I did that. I take again my pencil to mix the cut lines. Now, I put the cut line there, therefore, I have my filler, my B filler here. You see? And the last thing I do, I take my white and I do the highlights of my, the highlights of my cut line. Wait, I forgot a cut line. Now, the last thing we want to do is a little bit of red there. It's going to be, I don't know, the light, whatever. And here, we just do a little change of section to make sure that this looks a little bit more like a bumper. Right? Like that is better. Now, I can take, uh, I can take my brush and we can put a little bit of highlights on this sketch so that it looks even better. A big one here and another one there. You see? 